Hi, my name is Scott Breen and I'm a program manager in the Intune for Education product group. This video is going to introduce you to Windows 11 SE and then cover some key user and app experience differences compared with Windows 11. Now before we get started, if this is your first introduction to Intune, you might find our Intune for Education deployment workshop really useful. In that workshop, we cover an introduction to Azure AD and Intune and cover Windows apps, settings, and enrollment in much more detail. You can find the workshop at aka.ms slash i4e slash workshop videos. So what is Windows 11 SE? It's a new cloud-first Windows edition designed for education. Windows 11 SE offers the power of Windows 11 with simplified experiences and curated apps on affordable devices that are built for education prioritizing student privacy and modern management. Windows 11 SE is designed to be web first and supports progressive web apps. And now because Windows 11 is a cloud first operating system, that means that Windows 11 SE must be joined to Azure Active Directory and be managed by Intune or Intune for Education. These two products work together to provide your Windows 11 SE devices with secure cloud backed identity and device management accessible from school home, or anywhere with internet. The EDU optimized experience on Windows 11 SE comes with some key user experience differences. Microsoft OneDrive is configured to automatically sign in and configure known folder moves so that students have easy and quick access to their cloud files. Known folder move syncs the user's desktop, documents, and pictures to OneDrive. OneDrive's Files on Demand is also enabled by default, so students can see all their files straight away while maintaining offline access to any files that they've accessed. The File Explorer options for this PC and network are hidden, encouraging students to use their cloud storage. Applications like Command Prompt and PowerShell are blocked. And finally, applications are automatically opened maximized to the full screen so that students can focus on the task they're working on as we can see here with Minecraft Education Edition. The application experience on Windows 11 SE has been optimized to be cloud first. All of your favorite Microsoft 365 education applications are pre-installed like Teams, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and OneNote. There is also Whiteboard, Minecraft Education Edition, and Flipgrid, and a special web app version of Outlook that works really well on these devices. Windows 11 SE supports installing websites as apps, sometimes called Progressive Web Apps, or PWA. Browser extensions, such as Microsoft Editor, are also supported through the Edge or Chrome extension store. With Intune, admins can deploy select applications from a list of EDU-only apps. Application installation is blocked locally, so only IT has control over which apps are deployed. For more details about the EDU-only apps that can be installed on Windows 11 SE, check out aka.ms slash Windows 11 SE apps. If an application you need is considered to be one of the approved categories like content filtering or test taking as an example, you can request Microsoft consider supporting your application for use on Windows 11 SE at this website as well. Remember that is aka.ms slash Windows 11 SE apps. And remember to check back every now and then to see if any new apps are available. This video was your introduction to Windows 11 SE, the new EDU first cloud operating system designed for low cost devices. We talked about the cloud first design and the need for Azure Active Directory join and management with Intune or Intune for Education. We then talked about the user and app experiences and how they are different from Windows 11. In some of our future videos, we'll discuss some deployment tips in terms of applications, settings, and enrollment. Make sure you subscribe to our channel to be notified as they're released. We'll add them to our Windows 11 SE playlist, which is available directly at aka.ms slash i4e slash Windows 11 SE. In the video description, you'll find links to our Windows 11 SE overview site, where you can find a catalog of Windows 11 SE devices, including Microsoft's very own Surface SE. There are also links to the Windows 11 SE apps page, the Intune for Education deployment workshop, and our really useful getting started with cloud-native Windows endpoints guide. Thank you.